You give me a shaz bot. What's that? Nanu nanu, brother. Nanu nanu. <laughs> Off to the Green Industry Expo in Louisville, Kentucky. All right, Stan. Thanks, buddy. Concrete to get the credit card out of your missus's hand. Get her off Facebook. Yeah! Yeah! How do you like working next to this guy? It's crazy. <laughs> Wait till tomorrow. <laughs> you may not be a producer, but you're involved in it. In some way, you are related to that macro trend. And there's four different streams of folks in the room, and but you are all related to the same macro uh, pressures. It's pretty simple. Define, delegate, and lead. place better be good. I ran here. You could. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. You're Pete, give me the give me the promo on the showcases that we're sponsoring this year. They're going to be awesome. Job site crashers went to a bunch of cities, ended up in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> put in a rain harvesting system. Incredible installation. Permeable pavement on top. Rain harvesting below, all overflowing into great ponds. Showcases start early January? Early January, 55 cities. Nice. Last year we saw 15,000 people. We're hoping to break that record. It's going to be awesome. And I'll be there. Aquascape yep. will be there. Absolutely. We love having you with the basins, man. It's going to be great. Thanks for breakfast. You're welcome, brother. Lifestyle, the lifestyle the buddy. This fountainscapes help deliver it. <laughs> Brian, I don't know his last name. Brian Helfrich. <laughs> 20 years ago, 21st birthday, flew into New Jersey and did a build a pond day at my house in my front yard when I worked for Aquarius Supply. So we had like 20 contractors show up, all the boulders show up, and he spent the entire day there digging the hole, putting everything in, and, and built this beautiful pond. It was a 11 by 16 yeah, yeah, with a 10 foot stream waterfall. Yep. And I'll tell you what, I love that until the day I sold the house. Nice. So I'm sitting in the parking lot waiting to meet Keith Kalpas for the first time in person. He is a YouTuber for the green industry 
and I was gonna meet him tonight, but he said he would not be able to talk because he'll be so swarmed with people. So I'm sitting waiting for him to get back from the GIE convention to uh, pick his brain about uh, how this whole world of YouTubing and vlogging works. The easiest way to be successful in life is to find somebody doing what you wanna do and do what they did. Keith's doing a damn good job, and this is what a CEO of a company will do when he's interested in finding something out and learning. Find the people that are good at it and working with them. Should be here any moment right now. And here he comes, and look at what he is doing. Keith, I meet the YouTuber celebrity himself. What's up, bro? <laughs> How you doing, man? Good? Good, good to meet you in person. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> I can already see as soon as I watch your vlogs and videos that they're so good. I have no idea <laughs> that this party was at such a cool place. Okay, so what you're gonna do is... This is super cool. What is this place? Mega Cavern. Look at this place. It's a giant underground party area. I don't know how else to describe it. You gotta tell me your story. All right, I'm KB with KB Cutters. 13 years old out of Alabama. I'm Evan Diaz uh, with Clean Cuts Lawn Care. I'm 14 years old. I'm out of Nashville, Tennessee. You guys both have not only your own lawn cutting businesses, but your own YouTube, YouTube channels. Channel. Yes. All right, tell me the story, kid. So, there was this job that showed up in our next door neighbor. It was this lady who needed someone to cut their yard. It was super overgrown. I bidded her blind $25. Now, this should have been a $125 job. Uh -huh. I did this thing for $25, completely underbid, and that's the after path for $25. So you did good work even though you didn't make any money? Yes, made zero money off it. Probably lost money on fuel costs. And you're 13? 13. And you're part of Dirt Monkey University? Yes, the mastermind group. To learn how to bid? Yes, bidding and estimating. Show me that picture of you when you were a little kid. And you've got 14 accounts that you yes, take sir, care of? Yes, sir, I do. And you have your own YouTube channel with how many subscribers? Uh, almost 400. That's not bad. You guys know each other from YouTube and Instagram, Instagram and this yes, is your yep. first time meeting at the GIE show. Yep. All right, show me that picture. This is me. I was addicted to tractors and mowers at five years old. Oh, that is beyond. That's me on a walker mower. That is beyond cute. So this is what you want your career to be. Yes. So you guys are both playing hooky from school yeah, pretty much. to pretty come much. to real school, which is GIE. And come to a thing on a vlogging convention, huh? Yes. <laughs> that is pretty awesome. Well, you guys are going to be successful. You already are. Quite impressive, young Thank man. Thank you very much. You're welcome. You got to sign in, though, even though you're keeping out. Keep uh, <laughs> Nothing can stop an idea whose time has come. And it's come. Why do you think it's come now? Because it's easy to use. It's a platform now. Like, you don't have to be a genius to shoot a video, right? I mean, you don't have to. I would have never been able to do this 15 years ago. Oh, this is what I do at work. I don't have any fancy video. I do this. All right, I'm at a job right now. It's easy. That, that's why. Why do you think people follow? Why do you follow? I think it's personal. You connect with certain people. If I'm watching you, not like a landscaper. I, and then I'm, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm going to watch Keith Kalfas, like that video you just put out. That was yeah. fucking cool, man. So it, it's a personal thing. I don't connect with everybody, and, and you don't connect with everybody, but certain people are like Steve, certain people like Keith, certain people like Stan, certain people like all of us. So it's still quite early in the morning. It's been a whirlwind 48 hours, but I have absolutely enjoyed myself. My head is gonna explode with all of the stuff that I just learned from industry professionals that are professional vloggers that have inspired me to do the same thing as the pond guy. I got to meet for the very first time after being on his vlog channel maybe two years ago, Stanley from Dirt Monkey University, uh, who gave me some tips and insights, and then also uh, Keith Kalfas from Landscape Employee Trap. Uh, both these guys spent some time with me. I got to pick their brain. Kind of goes with my basic philosophy 
mean, one of the ways that I've been able to hack my level of success that I've been able to achieve, which is the easiest way to be successful in life is to find somebody doing what you want to do and do what they did. When I first moved into my first commercial building in 1995, right down the street in the same industrial park was uh, In The Swim. Turns out that they were mail order swimming pool parts supplier. And the guy who owned it was a man named Jim Coxworth. I asked to speak to Jim Coxworth as a new neighbor. The receptionist uh, gave me a look, called Jim, and amazingly, Jim was open because he spent the next two, two and a half hours with me showing me his entire operation. I asked Jim what was the best business decision he ever made. Like, if you've never asked anybody that question who you want to be successful from, ask what the best business decision they ever made in. If you ask me, I would say stopping it in the swim that day and listening to the advice of a guy who's been there and done that. Hey, you want to go left here.